If you need to decide to get to the gym this morning, this is it. Girl, get up. We are building that dream body and you're not gonna make it laying down in that bed eating all the snacks. Put them down. I don't care if you binge this weekend. I don't care if you drank too much. I don't care if you're tired. I don't care if you're in your feelings because your man is acting crazy or maybe it's the man that's not your man who's acting even crazier. It always happens like that. I don't care. Get up, put on your cutest gym set and we out the door in five minutes. Let's go. the gym with new hair some makeup and a different set of clothes also your girl has had a sinus infection for the past like seven days so if you hear me breathing heavy no you don't mind your business okay so I don't really know what I had all these plans for this weekend's video I was gonna plan a whole spend the weekend with me even though I don't be doing nothing hold on Keep dropping these towels anyway so i wanted to do this whole spend the weekend with me type video but your girl was out for the count yesterday i woke up and i was cleaning my apartment but i was winded i even went grocery shopping and i had to order the rest of my groceries midway through because i was winded literally like try being my size amy like that winded okay like oh it was crazy and then i guess today we'll just double as a what i eat in a day video slash meal prep with me because your girl fell off a little bit and let me tell you something being sick is really no excuse however i actually weighed myself this morning and i was five pounds lighter than what i was last week and it's because i guess that's what happens when you don't eat i haven't been enjoying food lately or haven't had much of an appetite because i can't taste or smell anything and before you guys hop on here talking about some she has covid no i don't have covid i was tested twice and it it came out negative both times I just have a sinus infection but as I'm starting to get over the sinus infection I am starting to feel a little bit better and my appetite is finding her way back because you know your girl likes to eat so today I have a recipe that I want to share with you for some awesome healthy breakfast cookies that have oats and peanut butter and chocolate chips and all that good stuff in there I'm really excited to show you those because I have been loving those I actually was eating them for breakfast right before I got my side sorry, right before I got my sinus infection, but I made them again in hopes that in a couple of days I'll be able to taste them again, but I absolutely love them. I'm also going to be having a kale power salad with a bunch of roasted veggies, like Brussels sprouts, butternut squash, cause y'all know that's like my new thing. I'm a creature of habit and now I have to keep eating the same exact things. And then also I have been on a sourdough kick. So I'm gonna be having a pesto and turkey sandwich on sourdough. So without further ado, let's just jump into the video. Oh my God, where are my manners? Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ree. If you are new here, hello girl. Welcome to the family. We gonna be besties by the end of this video, okay? I post a lot of lifestyle videos. Right now I'm highlighting my faith and my fitness journey. So if this is something that you're interested in, please be sure to like and subscribe. That way you don't miss any future content I have coming for you in the future. If you are returning, hello. It's nice to see you again. Your girl missed filming videos, but you know the sickness tried to take me out, but here we are. Okay, so I don't know about you, but when the holidays come around, I feel like that's a time where I go buck wild with my food. So I'm really making sure that I'm buckling down so I can meet the goals that I have for myself. So I am meal prepping this week. I'm not meal prepping a full week's worth of meals because first of all, I'm weird about the meals sitting that long. It's Sunday, November 18th and no, it's not. 
why does my watch say the 18th? It is Sunday, November 21st, I believe. I have to fix my watch. Anyway, so it is the Sunday before Thanksgiving and I'll be going home. I'll be traveling home for the holidays. And you know, your family has all that yummy food that you wanna eat. I wanna make sure that I'm sticking to my meal plan so that I can reach the goals that I have set for myself. So I want to have that balance. It's all about finding that balance. So this week I'm preparing for breakfast. These chocolate oat healthy breakfast cookies, they look like this freaking fire through some pumpkin seeds in there for a little razzle dazzle but i made these yesterday and i let them completely cool and what i plan to do for the rest of the week is have one or two of them based on how hungry i am and then i'm sick i mean like like okay i'm literally sick but like i'm sick because i ordered the alani new fit shakes and the flavors cookies and cream and the chocolate and i can't taste anything so i can't even drink them right now because i don't i can't like i I can't enjoy them. So I'm probably just going to make regular protein shakes or like the Owen protein shakes that I usually have because I can just go off memory of what they taste like. I wanna give a review of these, but I don't want to give them right now because I can only just like feel texture, taste texture if that's a thing. So I really want to hopefully this week hopefully by like Wednesday or Thursday I have my taste back and I can enjoy all the food I'm going to be eating but especially these so I'll be having these breakfast cookies with one of these or maybe an Owen protein shake or like the organ let me show you the other the protein powder that I usually use okay this is the other protein powder that I usually use it's the organ organic protein powder and the flavored chocolate chocolate coconut i usually get the regular chocolate one but this what they were out of it so i got it in the chocolate coconut and it's fine um so i'll probably just do that and like a little like protein smoothie just throw in like a frozen banana some almond milk maybe some frozen berries and then just blend up and call it a day so i'll have that in conjunction with my breakfast cookie and like i said i don't know if i'll have one or two um it just depends on how hungry i am that day so right now i'll go ahead and i'll insert the footage on how i made those cookies and then we'll be back when it's lunchtime. Okay everyone, so it is lunchtime. So I'm going to be having this pesto and turkey sandwich with arugula on sourdough. And then I paired it with some cucumbers and some cilantro jalapeno hummus. Now, 
I don't actually like cilantro so I'm hoping that I don't taste this because like I can't actually taste food yet so this might not fly you know <laughs> down the road like I might have to throw it away because I can't I don't like cilantro it tastes disgusting okay and you can come for me and say that my palate is immature but I don't like it so um I'm gonna be having this and then I'm just going to insert the clip on how I prepared it and then I'll talk to you guys when it's dinner time taste a single thing on this sandwich but I know it's hitting I know it's fire like oh Lord please I will never ever ever take for granted the days where I could smell and taste ever again if you would just please return those senses back to me immediately immediately thank you it's busted even though I can only taste like textures and like salty Whatever, I'll take it though, I'll take it though. so it's a lot later and I'm getting a little bit hungry and it's really even hard to say that it's hungry like I feel that like my stomach is growling but do I want to eat absolutely not because I can't enjoy anything like I just this is just really very ghetto okay today I was really productive I was actually like editing this video as I went cleaning my house it's Sunday tomorrow I have parent teacher conferences and then Tuesday I have parent teacher conferences and then I'm off for Thanksgiving break so I'm like the Sunday scaries have not set in yet because I don't got nothing to be scared about I'm not teaching anything tomorrow but I noticed that I was starting to feel a little bit like sick sick and I was like oh I wonder why that is and it was because like I literally haven't taken my medicine in like eight hours so oops here I am I'm about to take it I don't know if anybody else can relate to this but I have such a hard time swallowing pills like it's just not it for me like it, it's a whole production you have to have enough water the water to pill ratio gotta be like together it's just like I don't know every time I do it like I feel like I'm gonna choke or like I'm choking also you see the size of these things they're huge anybody else remember like back when the back in the day when like strep was a thing people got like a sore throat or strep throat and they gave you an antibiotic and they gave you like amoxicillin and they try to give you those big thick chalky white horse pills like didn't I just tell y'all that I can't even swallow saliva I can't even swallow air and here you are thinking that I'm gonna be able to swallow this no thank you no thank you um so let me tell you something if I could I would take this in liquid form but I didn't feel like leaving my house today so the pills will have to do so hold on bear with me the audacity to have to take two not just one <clears throat> oh I feel it right here anyway now that that is out the way hopefully I start to feel a little bit better I've been editing like I said today I've been editing this video I'm trying to be more consistent trying to put myself on a schedule I'm just trying to figure out like what kind of content I want to create I definitely love doing lifestyle stuff but like I'm really bad at fashion like I 
Fashion is not for me. I literally just wear like athleisure clothes all the time. I mean, make it do like a haul or something like that. I don't know. You guys can give me some inspiration out in the chat. Let me know what you guys would want to see. So in my house, as background is I'm always watching YouTube videos. But while I was editing, I was watching my girl, Chloe Yasmin. Listen, if you guys don't know who she is, she's the girl on YouTube who's like, has all the smell good house products, smell good body products. And I never knew that people put that much effort into smelling she'd be layering products like when i see her i i know i will smell her before i see her and honestly when i grow up i want to be just like her i literally you are lucky that i put on deodorant and a few squirts of perfume a day and call it a day she's like lathering soaps and exfoliants and then lathering up lotions and hair products and i'm like oh girl give me the nivea give me some perfume spray 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 deodorant one two and be done but she she wanted something. Anyway, so like I said, it is dinner time. My stomach is growling. No, I'm not going to be able to enjoy the food, but I might as well just eat it because I'm not trying to die. But I prepared my salad. Here it is. It looks bomb. And I'm going to show you in another clip how I prepared it, the steps I took, and all the ingredients that I used so you guys can enjoy that. But aside from that, really, I'm not going to be snacking because I barely feel like eating real food. Um, So this is what I eat in a day is really just not of what I eat in a day. I mean, it's what I'm forcing myself to eat right now, but I guess it kind of puts in perspective though, like how much food plays into your life. Like if I can't enjoy my food, I don't want to eat it. So I must be really enjoying the food that I make because I just want to eat all the time. But also I wanted to share that I have been drinking water, copious amounts of water. Like honestly, I might drown myself from the inside out with how much water I've been drinking because everybody always tells me that you need to have plenty of fluids in and I haven't been able to taste coffee. So why make coffee, right? Why drink anything else but water? So I've been sipping on water all day long. I've been peeing all day. And yeah, so that's kind of kept me really content I mean, water naturally just has no flavor. I mean, like water, you know, certain waters have a flavor for sure. For sure they do. You, we know this, like Dasani, BG, they all have their own taste. But this is just my Brita and honestly nothing fancy. So I've been sipping on this all day. So this is what I eat in a day consisted of my breakfast cookies, which I hope you guys will try. I will link the recipe down below. I had to see if I can find it. I found it on Pinterest like a couple years ago, but I found the screenshots in my phone and I was really wanting to make them. So I hope you guys try them. Let me know in the comments which you, if you guys try them if you like them and what you maybe would add or tweak but yeah as for meal prepping because i did say i was going to meal prep i essentially can't meal prep sandwiches because you know the bread be getting all soggy so what i did was i just chopped up all of my veggies i also bagged up my cookies hold on let me show you what they look like these are my cookies i just put them in bags and i put them in there with two probably won't eat two but you know i'm being optimistic here because hopefully your girl gets her appetite back because i don't like this like and then for my salads i basically just put kale and five little containers Containers and then just divvied up all of the toppings. Everybody pray that my taste is back, especially by Thursday, because I'm gonna be sick if I'm sitting at a table full of soul food and I can't taste none of it. I'm gonna be irritated. I'm gonna eat it, but I'm gonna be irritated because I won't be able to enjoy it. So, so basically this is going to be the end of my what I eat in a day video. I'm so thankful for you guys for sticking around. Thank you so much for all the likes, the comments and subscribes. I really, really appreciate you and your support. Listen, we're trying to grow this team, grow this family, grow this page and I hope that this page can be a blessing to you so whatever you need whatever you're going through whatever you need inspiration from I hope you take what you need and you're able to apply it to your life remember it is not about perfection it's about progress and every day as long as you keep putting that effort in girl we're gonna have that dream body okay we're gonna have it we're going to have our lives we're gonna have that dream life okay if you have anything that you want to ask anything you want to see anything you want to suggest any love anything just please post it down in the comment section below you know I'll get back to you and until then I'll see you on my next